Senators will likely grill Comey on whether he thinks the president's actions amount to obstruction of justice. But Elaine, a Comey associate says that he wants to tell his story. But in doing that, he will not offer his legal opinion. Well, Jeff, what can we expect from Comey tomorrow? Well, I think we can expect some surprises. That is what he's known for in a lot of ways and in a lot of circles here in Washington, especially when it comes to his testimony on Capitol Hill. He's been on this big stage before, several times before, not only at the conclusion of the Clinton email server investigation, but also back in 2007 when he was on Capitol Hill talking about an encounter in the hospital room of John Ashcroft, who was then he, the attorney general at the time, and members uh, from the White House. You had Andy Card and Alberto Gonzalez. Uh, and so he talks about that confrontation over the Surveillance Act that was put on the books after 9-11. And so that was also riveting testimony. So what we can expect tomorrow from James Comey is really more riveting tele testimony. He is a storyteller in a lot of ways. He is very charismatic, uh, and he is used to this big spotlight on Capitol Hill. Well, Jeff, will there be any statements about whether the president obstructed justice? Well, it sounds like, according to people who are familiar with uh, his thought process around all this, it sounds like he is going to, to try and steer clear of that. We've heard him on Capitol Hill before declining to answer certain questions, uh, and we can expect to hear a lot more of that uh, tomorrow. We know that members of Congress on both sides, they will be grilling him, trying to get as many answers as they can uh, in uh, regard to the Russia investigation, also uh, as many answers as they can about his interactions with the president. Uh, but we should expect to hear uh, former FBI Director Comey decline to answer some questions because he doesn't want to tread on the special counsel investigation uh, either. So that's something that will be in the back of his mind as well. Uh, but this will be uh, one of the more memorable testimonies on Capitol Hill. All right, Jeff Pegues in Washington for us. Jeff, thanks.